Looking at number two, when you put a four over the first fraction and a 38 is the numerator for the second ratio, you will add the top two because the denominator is the same, it will remain the same in your answer. When you add eight and four, you get 12. The one carries and adds to the three to make it 42. Is 42 less than one half, equal to one half, or greater than one half? It might be useful if we use the number line to complete this work. Because the 38 is larger, I'm going to put the 38 in the first position to make it easier for me to color. So 38 is 2 less than 40, so I'll cover 10, 20, 30, and instead of coloring all the way to the 40, I'll color to the spot that's just 2 before that. And that indicates 38 one hundredths. To that, I added four one hundredths. So I'm going to come forward one, two, three, four. Now to figure out whether this is less than one half or larger than one half, it would be helpful to identify where one half is. So if you count from here, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50 is right here, which is the one half. So in this situation, you should have filled in less than one half. If you have any further questions about this problem, you can ask your learning coach or contact your teacher during open office hours. Also, if you did it slightly different and you put it, the fractions on this number line in the order that we have them here, you would have colored one, two, three, four of these. And then from there, you would color 38. Now, if I'm going from here to where the 38 would go, I'm going to count down to uh, or up from the four. I'm going to either go up 40 and then come back to or go up 30 and go forward eight more. So if I were to just go forward by tens, it would be 10, 20, 30, which brings us to four after this one right here. And that would be the 30. And then I would need to count eight more. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And that also brings us to the 42 over 100.